welcome to Graham and Pawpaw's Backyard for another Backyard Biology Project. Today's Backyard Project is made possible by several people in our family. It's about butterflies. The project um, started in North Carolina. The project was a gift from Nana in North Carolina to the boys, Ben and Will. And they carried their project, their butterfly project, uh, live across several states to Illinois for the uh, family reunion, or the McGrath family reunion in Utica, Illinois, by a famous state park, Illinois State Park, called Star Rock, where the boys got to visit. Well, <clears throat> back to the project. The live eggs from painted butterflies, a gift to Ben and Will from Nana, in North Carolina came to Illinois in two containers. Each container had uh, fertilized eggs that turned into what the boys and I call caterpillars. The caterpillars then, in a very special way, change um, into uh, cocoon-like form, uh, which we call a chrysalis. The chrysalis looks very different than the caterpillar, which you'll see during the project. I have captured with the boys some photographs of the live caterpillars feeding and then in short time changing completely into what some people call cocoons, which really are chrysalises. And the boys then, with their parents, Ben and Will, return to North Carolina, and the chrysalises will likely change again. The process of change, metamorphosis, is something that all insects go through. Well, at some time in a very few days, their beautiful chrysalises will release uh, painted butterflies, which this slideshow that follows will also have pictures of. Now, don't get painted ladies confused with the fabulously painted boats at San Francisco's famous uh, Pier 39. Fishman's Wharf, nor with the Victorian houses in the Haight-Ashbury district of San Francisco, which are also called Painted Ladies. Painted Ladies happens to be the name of the butterflies, which we hope Ben and Will will see sometime soon in the month of July in their home state, North Carolina. These butterflies have traveled several thousand miles before they even became butterflies. They'll lay eggs then, and who knows where the eggs will wind up being uh, adult butterflies. Enjoy the slideshow that follows.